The stage is set and the prospect mouth-watering. Two teams at the peak of their powers ready for a battle royal, serving as a true gauge of their ability to perform. Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray, getting ready to bring you all the action, accompanied by my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Doncaster Rovers facing Burnley. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Yanis Hadji and taking it away Dara O'Shea Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man, Stuart. What do you anticipate seeing from him? Well, the stats tell you everything. He's a top-class striker. Even when he's having a quiet game, he can still pop up with a goal, as we may well see today. Coman. Well, he gave it quite the blast, but nowhere close to the goal. Lucas Toro. This is a message for Alex O'Neill. Alex O'Neill. O'Shea. Twine. Saar in possession. Well, no stopping him. And effectively parried away by the keeper. Can they forge ahead? Still a chance. And a time for calm on the ball. Hadji. Well, he's featured on the back pages of quite a few newspapers in recent days, and the reports have been confirmed. He will, in fact, end his career at the end of the season. No two ways about it, Stuart. A big loss for the club. Yes, it really is. Obviously, he's going to be missed here. Very much a key player in the dressing room. No doubt they'll be looking to the transfer window to strengthen now. Morutsan. Well, they're almost extending an invitation to have them come at them. Attacking with vigor. And I'm hearing there's been a goal in the Fulham game. Alex Scott can fill us in. It's a goal from Manchester City. It's now 1-0 with 35 minutes played. Alex, thank you very much. Twine. Lucas Toro. Clean challenge. This is looking threatening. Chance to put them in front. And there it is, the opening goal, 1-0, and they'll feel they deserve it. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. So underway again here, one nil to score. Scott Twine. Barnes. Now let's see about the cross. Oh, too much elevation, couldn't keep it down. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. 
chances on. He had to score, and he does. Well, just look at the defending here. They've made it so easy for him in the end. That's just not good enough. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half-time here. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Right, let's join Alex Scott, shall we? Because there's been news of a goal in the Fulham match. It's a goal for Fulham. They're back level. It's one all with 49 minutes played. Thanks for the update, Alex. Well, moving the ball forward, they might be in business. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Oh, to trim back the lead. Oh, magnificent save! Well, he's just pulled off a great save there. What reaction from the goalkeeper that was. Now, how about the short corner? Nicely timed tackle. And over the byline, goal kick coming up. Just a quick reminder, we have more action from the Premier League coming your way. It's Doncaster Rovers facing Nottingham Forest. Well, Derek, I'm really looking forward to it. Always a great atmosphere in that stadium, and it should be an entertaining match. Chance to finish. Oh, yes, a goal. Exactly what they were looking for, and he's come up with it. Well, here we can see it again, and he does so well to skip beyond the defender. It just buys him that bit of time to get his shot away. That's a really nice goal. Three goals without reply. Now well, we're into the final half hour. He has teammates around him. Evangelos Pavlidis. Well, still an issue here. And the attack fizzling out. And a friendly reminder that we have more action from the Premier League coming up. It's Burnley facing Manchester City. That should be a tasty encounter. Plenty of quality in those two sides. Oh, it's developing nicely for them here. Well, whatever way you slice it, a long, long way from the target, Stuart. Well, a lack of technique and composure there. That's a bad miss. And they did have the ball, but not anymore. Saar. Shot attempted. And a goal this time. Applying the finishing touch. Just what the doctor ordered. Well, here you can see what a good goal this is. He hits it so cleanly and the keeper has no chance. That's a great strike. So on with the action. And 3-1 the scoreline at the moment. And that's very good refereeing to let the play flow. Pavlidis. Feeding it through. Oh, that surely had to go in. But marvellous defending. Now we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Losing possession a bit easily. Might work out. Well, they've really turned this into a contest. Momentum now with them. 
Well, here's the goal again, and what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Well, the action underway once more, and no shortage of entertainment. 3-2. And room now out on the flank. Dario Solaru. Real chance. And a save that keeps them believing. Well, he's given them a chance with that save, as you said. But will they get another opportunity? I'm not sure. Short corner favoured. And cleared away. Well, there's still scope for late drama here. Five minutes left, and just one goal between the sides. A chance maybe from the wide position. Can he finish them off? He's done it! What a climax to this game! Well, just look at this. That was so close to coming back into play. But it doesn't matter. They all count. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Bergen. Now with Barnes. And players waiting in the centre. So a goal kick is what's coming up here. Well, the action is going to continue for a while yet. We will have four minutes of stoppage time. Giannis Hadji. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. And a goal to settle the issue once and for all. Well, as the replay shows, it all started with that perfectly weighted ball over the top of the back line. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. And there it is, the final whistle. And the fans will be leaving the stadium with smiles on their faces. Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively, almost cutting through at will at times. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest.